the Rafale fighter jets are among the finest fighters in the world. Five of the 35 4.5 generation aircrafts arrived at the Ambala Air Station in India on the 29th of July. South Asia's most potent aircrafts have a capacity to reach double the speed of sound. The Omni-Roll aircraft has multi-role capabilities, which means that it can perform several missions in one flight, right from electronic warfare, air defense, ground support to in-depth strikes. This combat-proven aircraft was used by the French Air Force for its missions in Afghanistan, Libya, Mali, Central African Republic, Iraq and Syria. The Rafale jets have a wingspan of 10.90 meters and a length of 15.30 meters. The aircrafts are 5.3 meters in height and weighs 10 tons of which 9.5 tons comprise its external load. The fighter jet's maximum takeoff weight is 24.5 tons and can carry 11.4 tons of fuel both internal and external. Its ferry range is 3700 kilometers with 450 meters landing ground run and a 50000 feet service field. This 4.5 generation Rafale fighter jet can be tuned to deliver nuclear weapons. It comes with game-changing missiles such as the Meteor which is an air-to-air -air missile worth more than rupees 20 crores with a zero escape kill distance of 120 kilometers. Scalp, the long range air to ground standoff cruise missile worth more than 40 crores with a 600 kilometer range. The French Hammer air to ground precision guidance weapon system, which stands for highly agile and maneuverable munition extended range. The Mica air to air missiles are yet to be integrated and the Brahmos NG missiles are for future models. Rafale jets have the Israeli lightning pod for sensor commonality, RBE-2 active electronically scanned radar, front sector optronics FSO system which makes it immune to even radar jamming. Now coming to the pricing, the Rafale jet deal was struck at 7.878 billion euros of which the vanilla price of the aircraft which is the price of the basic aircraft amounts to 91 million euros. Single seaters cost 94 million euros each. The two-seater trainer aircrafts are priced at 3.42 billion euros. Weapons in the Rafale fighter jets cost 710 million euros. Indian-specific changes have cost us about 1,700 million euros. Supplies and simulators have amounted to 1,800 million euros, whereas performance-based logistics have cost us 353 million euros. In the year 2001, the Indian Air Force made a proposal to buy medium multi-role combat aircraft to the MMRCA for which Rafales were later selected. In 2004, the Indian bureaucratic system delayed the decision and global tender for MMRCA floated. In the year 2007, global request for the proposal was issued and in the year 2012, Rafales were selected or shortlisted and Dassault Aviation, the manufacturer of Rafale, was shortlisted as lowest bidder but no advancement was made on the deal. In January 2015, India approached the French side to know if a government-to-government -government deal could work out for small number of planes. In April of 2015, Prime Minister Narendra Modi travelled to Paris and announced to buy 36 Rafale jets. 18 months later, a deal was sealed. In the year 2016, India ordered for 36 Rafale combat jets and in the year 2020, it was on July 29 that five of the 36 jets finally arrived in India. The remaining jets will be delivered to India by the year 2022. Here are the other kinds of fighter jets with the Indian Air Force at present. Now, which are the aircrafts that the Rafale fighter jets compete with? China's J-20. The Rafale combat jets compete with China's J-20 jets, which are fifth generation jets. These have no combat experience while Rafales do, which makes Rafales superior as its combat is proven. Rafale also carries more fuel and weapons than the J-20, which makes it stronger in combat. Now coming to Pakistan's F-16. The F-16 Fighter Falcon, a fourth generation single engine supersonic multi-role fighter aircraft, gives tough competition to Rafale. In a dogfight, however, Rafales would have a slight edge over the F-16s due to its capacity to hold more weapons. The Indian Air Force ranks fourth in the list of strongest air forces in the world after US, Russia and Israel. The IAF currently has 31 squadrons 
and they assess a need for 42 squadrons to tackle a two-front war simultaneously with Pakistan and China. Rafale fighter jets are being dubbed as the game changer as it is said that the induction of these fighter aircrafts multiplies India's firepower manifold.